Welcome back fans of all things Disney. Today I have a little bit of magic mail for you and I also wanted to give you a bit of an update on Vlogmas. I am on Thanksgiving vacation right now uh, so I have the entire week to really start to get myself together for Vlogmas. I am committed to one video every single day. My dogs, I don't even know, they're destroying something over there, so that'll be fantastic. They'll be running through here before too long. But I did pick up some magic mail out of my P.O. box the other day, my very first two pieces of mail from my P.O. box. And oh my gosh, I opened that door and I saw packages sitting in there and I just got so excited. Now, I'm sure that for those of you that have much, much bigger channels and you've had P.O. Box for years and uh, that seems kind of silly to you. Hello, Iris. But for me, it was just, it was a wonderful experience. So in addition to Magic Mail, I also wanna give you a little bit of an update on Vlogmas, specifically on one of the, oh, <laughs> Iris one of the activities that I decided that I really wanna do for Vlogmas, and that is a Christmas card exchange. So I'm gonna to talk to you about that in just a little bit. I am dying to get into these packages. So in addition to the two that I received in my P.O. box, I also received a package that somehow got tucked away here at the house um, because I didn't think that I had gotten it yet, and I did. This is coming from one of my customers in California. Um, I am a personal shopper and she does shop with me. Her name is Reagan and she is, oh, I'm sorry. Why did I say California? Reagan in um, Florida here. Uh, so she sent me something all the way from St. Augustine. Um, but this is a pin that she um, had gotten and I had a pin that she wanted, so we did a little bit of a trade. Um, I tucked my pin into um, the mail, into one of her last shipments, and this one she just sent to me, and oh my goodness, look at that. That is Doug from Up. She knows how much I love hot air, those hot air balloon pins. And while this is an entirely different series, I wanna say that this one comes from Shanghai Disneyland. I'm not entirely positive on that, um, but I know it's not one of the ones that is sold here in the States, I don't believe, um, but she knows my daughter loves Doug, loves that animal um, from the movie Up. It is kind of her spirit animal. We had a golden retriever that just reminds her of Doug, and so anything Doug that we can get our hands on we try to grab. So now I have my Doug pin. Reagan, thank you so much. This was so sweet of you to send this to me. And I'm hoping that you like the pin that I sent to you. Um, and thank you, thank you, thank you. This will make my daughter's day when I get that into her hands. So thank you very much. All right, so my next little piece of magic mail, this is coming from Joyce in California. That's probably the reason that I made that mistake. My apologies there. But Joyce in California, she messaged me, um, oh my goodness, maybe a week or so ago. And she showed me that she was thinking of me and she picked something up for me at... Oh, sorry about that. I'm still covered in boxes from the last shopping trip and the dogs just kind of ran through here and it was just a disaster for a second. But so she uh, was thinking of me and um, so she got me this awesome pin from the Girard Deli store in Hollywood. So let me show you. She gave me a little card here to go with it and I don't know that she would know this but Tangled is not one of my favorite movies, but this whole scene here, at, um, at last I see the light, I believe is the name of the song, and um, I just love it. I love the entire scene. I have um, a painting of it up way top, <laughs> you can't quite see it, um, but this is gorgeous, a gorgeous note card. Thank you so much for that, Joyce. And it says, Melissa, I hope you love this stitch pin. Thank you for all you do. Disney brings me so much happiness. And it's fun to share that love with, for all things Disney, love Joyce. And that, that is gorgeous. And wait until you see this pin because she did send me a picture of it. 
in advance and oh my <laughs> girls girls stop go 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 they are wrestling like right here Whew. sorry about that all right so look at that pin oh my word it's kind of perfect for me because i love stitch and i love disney foods and we have Stitch eating movie popcorn. So this is coming from the Disney Studio Store in Hollywood. I can't believe that when I was out there in California, I didn't go to this store. I feel like that's going to have to happen the next time that I go out. Although I don't know when the next time is I will go out. Girl, stop. My goodness. Whew. Every time, I, if they, one of them's in the house, it's manageable. Now Masha's eating the box that the camera's on. Maj, really? Masha, Masha Bean, come here. Are you gonna hop up in my lap? Come here, come here. She's like, no, I wanna play, Mom. No, Iris, no, 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 you go play. Okay, so um, everything just went flying. Uh, so my apologies for that, but they have now gravitated to another room in the house which thank goodness, maybe now I can go ahead and I can finish up, but my goodness, they are fun. <laughs> I know some of you really, really do enjoy seeing them. So let me find my pin. Everything kind of went flying. Thank goodness I had tucked my pin back in the bag before that happened, but um, so yeah, Stitch and Popcorn is awesome. Joyce, this, this is perfect, perfect. Thank you so much. I love having this for my collection. Thank you so much. And thank you for being such an amazing customer. Same thing with you, Reagan. I mean, to even just think of me for this, I, it's just, it's so sweet. And I'm just so grateful. So in addition to being um, customers with personal shopping, you guys are great subscribers for the channel. You're always commenting and always so positive and I'm so appreciative. Um, so this next and last package that I have for my magic mail, this is coming to me from Debbie in California, Camarillo, California. And I just like, look at the bubble wrapping. It's just so sweet. When I, when I saw the colors and everything, it, it just kind of brought a smile to my face. Um, so Debbie is also a pin fanatic. Um, she does the most amazing, most amazing backdrops for her pins. They're really, really gorgeous. Um, and I know that she was sending me, like this just feels very thick for what I was expecting. I think she overdid it again because she did this one other time where I was expecting one little thing and I got lots of goodies in my um, little package. So yes, I've got lots and lots of goodies here. So I have a card, I have um, an envelope, and I have something wrapped up. So let's just take a look and see. I'm gonna start with my note card first because, and I'll explain in a second, but um, for those who watch the channel, I have been talking about different things that I wanted to do with Vlogmas, including the Christmas card exchange and, um, and also the, um, maybe even if anybody had Christmas pins that you wanted to send to me for the advent calendar, that we could do that. So let's just take a look and read this note card first. It says, uh, Melissa, happy holidays. Here is my contribution to your advent calendar wrapped in Jared Maruyama paper once your, and your Christmas card. Wishing you and your family the most magical of holidays. Oh my goodness, Debbie. So that's like two things that you're doing for the um, for our vlog mess. That is amazing. And she also included, let's see here, she's got um, a business card that was tucked in there. So I, I'm gonna have to ask her. I don't know that I'm supposed to share all of this information in the video and I'm, I'm hesitant. So Debbie, if you wanna just let me know if you want me to share this in, in the video, I will do that. 
um, but she does have an amazing channel and what I'll do is I will put the link to her channel in the description box below so that you can maybe check out some of her different pin videos and things that she does but okay so this is very exciting um, I had shared with everybody that what I wanted to do is I want to do a pin advent calendar um, where I have a different mystery pin in each pocket of the advent calendar. I know a lot of people do that, but what I was hoping to do is to do all Christmas themed pins. Um, I have two because I purchased a Nutcracker set, but then they came out with those hot cocoa pins and I love those. I I really would love the entire collection. So I was going to purchase several boxes to fill out my advent calendar. The problem is those are sold out everywhere. And a lot of the other Christmas mystery pins that they have are not necessarily ones that I'm all that interested in. I'm not a huge fan of those sugar cookie pins that they came out with. I do like the small world pins that they came out with, but those are more of a Disneyland item. Maybe now the festival of the holidays is uh, going to be up and running. Maybe I'll be able to find something that I really, really do like. Um, but for right now, I've got my heart set on those hot cocoa pins. And while I was kind of deciding what I wanted to do with the advent calendar, one of my cust I'm sorry, subscribers had given me the suggestion of, well, why not just let people know that if they have a holiday Christmas pin, if they want to send it kind of wrapped up, that can be the pin that gets pulled for the advent calendar that day. So it's a little bit of um, audience participation, definitely a mystery pin. I would have no idea what this holiday pin is. Um, so that'll be kind of fun uh, to open and it, it'll be specifically from Debbie so truthfully this will probably be the very very first pin that I open in the advent calendar so I will set that aside with her name on it and it'll get tucked right into the pouch though it's a little bit big to get tucked in, into the pouch I'm sure that I can come up with something that's a little bit crafty so Debbie thank you for your contribution for day one of my pin advent vlog mess and then the other thing that she sent me this is a Christmas card so what I had offered and what I had asked everybody if they thought would be a good idea is would you like to do a Christmas card exchange if you send me a Christmas card I can send a Christmas card back to you and then each day for vlogmas I can open a handful of the Christmas cards and kind of give a little bit of a shout out to those of you that were sending those so there's that um, sense of uh, community that's being built and I love 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 paper Christmas cards I do and truthfully a lot of people don't send them anymore so if you think that she would be interested in participating in the Christmas card exchange I do have my PO box information in the description box below all that I ask is that if you're going to send me a card if you can please make sure that I have received that card um, I'll put the exact date in there, but if I could have it by the date that's listed in the description box, simply because um, my PO box is not in the town where I live, it's actually closer to the town where I work. Um, it's on my way home. So it just, it's easier for me to stop there than to go to the one that's in the town where I live. So if, um, unfortunately, I wouldn't be going back there after we were on Christmas break. So I will put all that information in the description box below, but hopefully some of you would be interested in doing a Christmas card exchange, but I know I have at least one Christmas card for day one of Vlogmas. So thank you again, Debbie, for that. And I did want to share with you guys, I went on to Amazon and I think eBay, and I, I started to find some really awesome Disney Christmas cards that were pretty inexpensive. So I've started to pick those up. I have some Winnie the Pooh ones coming as well and I think there's a princess one that's coming out I don't even know because I just found some really good prices and I went ahead and I grabbed so I have a few different varieties of Christmas holiday cards that I am going to be sending out to anybody who does send me a Christmas card to share with all of you so um, last thing that I have for this video just a little bit of an update for vlogmas in addition to the pin calendar that I am making for myself I also was able to get my hands on the coveted advent window calendar this is the tis the season to be jolly look at the pins that are in there there are 24 pins and they 
taken together make up those four different um, window views of the different characters. One is a Winnie the, Pew, Winnie the Pooh um, window, one is Lady and the Tramp, one is uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, and one is of course Mickey and the gang. So I'll take it as a whole, these will make up those four beautiful windows, holiday windows. And what I really love, let's see if you can see that there, is that you have those little slide out boxes where those pins are. That means that in subsequent years, I will be able to use this as my pin advent calendar. I was looking for the Christmas tree one that they had had at the Disney store. Um, I think it was last year, or maybe the year before, and the only place I could get it was at the Disney store in the UK. And then with shipping, oh my word, it was gonna be a, a disaster. So I decided against that, and then when I saw that this had been sold out within, I think, minutes of the first day that it was posted on the Disney store, um, online, I just assumed I was not going to be able to get it. But when I went into Pin Traders the other day, they had a few left on the shelf. This is a limited edition set, limited edition of 1200. Um, so this will be one of the very, f I don't have a lot of limited edition pins. So this one will definitely, um, kind of start to make my limited edition collection. And I'm just kind of grateful that I was able to get this. So this, I will be opening one pin every single day. My, um, personalized advent calendar, whether they're all Christmas themed or not, um, will be opened every single day and we will have at least, hopefully, one or two Christmas cards every single day as well. Um, so for my Vlogmas, and then there will be some other content that is kind of added on to that. So Vlogmas is shaping up to be a lot of fun and hopefully you'll stick around for that. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel so that we can get you entered into our November drawing. And if you are new to the channel, every single month we do a drawing for a box of mystery goodies. Those mystery goodies are kind of specialized and customized to you. So whoever is the winner, you just send me a list of the things that you are most interested in, your wants and your wishes, and then we go shopping for you. Um, but you do have to be a subscriber to be entered. New subscribers in the month get three entries into the drawing. Existing subscribers already have one entry as our thanks for being an existing subscriber. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me at Mickey's Magical Delivery at gmail.com. And until our next video, bye bye.